so this is the next stop on our tour, and this is the cutting department. So on either side of us then we have the master Christian cutters, and they're working on those pieces that I showed you marked up from the other department. Now there's two different kinds of cutters. It's not good and bad cutters, it's a little bit more complicated than that, okay? So I'm going to show you on this piece. On the upper section here is wedge cutting. Okay, wedge cutting will take shapes like diamond shapes, violet shapes, etc. And that's one type of cut. The other style of cutting is called flat cutting or rind tour cutting, generally found on the larger stem areas of the piece. They're both separate crafts, so a wedge cutter doesn't do flat cutting and vice versa. A quality check is performed after the wedge cutting and a similar check after the flat cutting. You can take it as a given that it better be perfect or the other department won't accept it, okay? The standards here are incredibly high and they're very territorial about the job that they do. You can pass this around if you want to see the two types of cut. So um, what makes their job extremely difficult here, they work with diamond wheels and they spin around at 3000 revolutions per minute and they have to work through a constant flow of water as well to keep the wheels cooled down. You can see Tom there working on wedge cutting there at the moment and you can see that flow of water. Similarly his colleague Bernard just behind here as well, he has to work. It makes their job a little bit difficult. So um, the guys are working away through that little uh, flow of water there. Now, a small amount of the work we do in the factory here is done by automatic cutting machines. We do about 6% of our work with automatic cutting machines. So just down here on the right-hand side where the green lights are, are automatic cutting machines. It will never do all the job. It will do about 70% of the work. Then when it's done, then it's passed up to the guys on either side to finish the job by hand. There's probably pieces spinning around in there if you want to have a look. And there's samples of that machine on the shelf just on the left-hand side. So you can have a look at all of those if you want to, take any photos you want, and then we're going to move to our next area which we'll be sculpting. Thank you.